Hello YouTube, Caitlin here, and do you know how young is too young to fall in love? It's another subscriber question! Yes! So basically, if you're say, nine years old, and you think that you found the love of your life, are you actually in love? No, probably not. What? I know, I know, please don't be mad at me. I'm just trying to be reasonable. Why can't you be in love when you're nine or 11? What about 16? Well, you can, but it's just not the same kind of love that say adults have when they decide to stay together forever and get married and all that kind of stuff. So when you're nine or 11 or even 16, your brain has not fully developed yet. Like your body might be close to adulthood, but your brain is just a few years behind. And even though you think you do, you also don't really understand what love is. Or rather, you don't really understand how love translates between love is in a dating sense and love in a friend or family sense. When you're younger and your brain is still developing, it's really easy to love lots of things. Like something is just very simple and it, you like it and so suddenly you love it. And if you don't believe me on that, go hang out with a toddler or five-year-old for a little while because within five minutes they will have decided whether or not they love you or they hate you. But despite what you might feel, like this is the biggest and most great love that I've ever experienced, it's probably just a giant crush. You're feeling extreme affection for a person, not love of your life, I found my soulmate type of feeling. But he is my soulmate and we're gonna run away together and live happily ever after and you are wrong! Okay, here's a good question. Have you met or even are friends with this person? Because a big issue here is that we are very easily able to fall in love with people that we have never even met. They have observable qualities that we like about them and then we fantasize about all these other qualities that they may have that we are attracted to and so we just kind of become starstruck with them and make them into this fantasy person. Maybe it's Harry Styles from One Direction, or maybe it's the guy that lives down the street. Who knows? Okay, so then is it 16? Can I fall in love at 16? Uh, sort of? Oh, you're so infuriating! Again, at 16 you're still developing, and although you are more mature then you are still not really as mature as you would be as an adult. I've met people that started dating when they were 14 and are now married with kids at 25, so it is completely possible for you to meet your soulmate when you're 14 years old. However, I don't think that the love they felt for each other when they were 14 is the same kind of love that they feel for each other when they're 25. It develops over time and I imagine that the reason that they're married and have two kids is because they have matured in both themselves and in their love. Basically, I think it's a process. We get bigger and bigger crushes as we grow up. We explore what it means to be attracted to another person and to allow them into our most intimate mental spaces. And we figure out how relationship love is different than friend love or family love. Love. So maybe you will fall in love when you're nine years old. Yay! But are you going to marry that guy or girl? Probably not. And that's okay. I just wouldn't go around proclaiming your love to the world from the rooftops because it just it's probably not gonna go over well. No one's gonna take you seriously. So what do you think? How old do you think someone should be before they fall in love? Tell me down in the comments and remember to like, favorite, share, and subscribe if this video made you smile. Also, when I was doing research for this video, I found out that my friend Josh had done a video on how young is too young to date. And so if you're interested in that topic as well, go over here and check out his video. See you guys next Thursday. <laughs>